Hello everyone this is Kushagr welcome to our youtube channel dev town if you like the content do like share and subscribe to our channel so we'll be seeing a series of videos required for you to get a good understanding of web development so students in today's video we would be designing this project so i have explained the detailed explanation of what this project is and how i would be designing this project in my previous video so we would be covering this whole project and we would be doing the coding part today so this is the new york times page that is your news new york times page so we would be designing this so to design this uh, project you need to first open your vs code in one folder so i have already opened the vs code in a folder and you already know how to open the folder so kindly please open that and uh, click on this new file icon and type index dot html file to create the html file and quickly generate your html boilerplate code and you already know how to generate your boilerplate code so i'll change the title to new york n e w new york times so let me just type the new york times so it's the new york times and uh, the title is change and let me just change this y to as capital so title is ready and let me just quickly change to style dot css file so i have generated two files that is your index dot html and style dot css and uh, i would be linking this file so let me just link it as well so link and relationship would be style dot css so relationship would be style sheet and href would be styles dot css so i have generated that so first of all first thing that we would be creating would would be div with a class of container so i have created div with a class of container and the next thing that we would be doing is we would be having one more div that is with a class of header so header so header is there and inside this header i would be having one h1 tag and inside this h1 tag i would be saying the new york times new york y o r k new york times so i have written this the new york times and the next thing that i would be adding is an h6 and inside this h6 i would be giving today's date or any date so let me just give the demi date all as well so that is 06 and let me just say it as 2022 and let's just say it's friday so i have given this dummy date and now i would be having one more div and inside this div i would be having a class as new so i've already given this class and now we would be having one more div and inside this div sorry uh not div with a class so we would be having article uh, big class so i have given this class as article big and inside this first of all we would be having an image so students i have already copied the images in the one notepad so i already have the source code so i would be pasting that in the description of the link as well so that you can get the link so there would be no issues in the link so next thing that we would be having is another div that is your div uh, with a class of article article content so article content and inside this we would be having one h2 tag so we would be copying the content so let me just copy this content that we would be having so we would be having this content let me just let me just copy this content uh. and paste it over here and let me just now again say a paragraph tag and inside this paragraph tag i would be copying this content and i would be pasting it over here so let me just copy this content and all tab and paste it over here so this is what the first code is and the now i would be having the similar kind of code so let me just copy this part and paste it some more times so 
let me just paste it one two and three times so let me just first close this first article big and uh, now i would be working on the second time so i would be having one article medium like this sorry no not this i need to alter this so article medium so medium so medium article medium and inside this article medium i would be having your uh image and then again your uh, content and this similar thing so let me just copy this image so uh, let me just copy it control c and uh, let me just remove this and paste this over here and uh, i have to change the content and to copy the content let me just copy this over here so i would be saying control c and then i would be doing i would be changing this that is control d and then i would be doing something like this that is control c and then i would be changing this control c and uh, again i would be having one more article medium medium and uh, i would be again copying the link that is the next link so let me just copy it control c and uh, let me just change it just a second so link is changed now i would be having the another content let me just shift it over here as well and let me just shift back towards the tab so control c and uh, let me just change this thing so i've changed it and now i would be having the paragraph that i would be copying it from here and i would be changing it over here so paragraph is also changed so article medium is also ready now i would be having your few three articles small so let me just copy it two more times so one and two so article small so article article small or let me just check with this yeah one article big and then i would be having your three articles small so let me just go back towards the tab part and uh, your two article big and then let me just copy this content so i need to scroll it down to check with this image so control c and i would be having one article big so i would be copying pasting this content since this is your big article so that's why i'm having article big as the class so let me just copy this and uh, i would be changing this so content is changed control v and uh, i have copied this content so control c and uh, let me just change it over here and control v so content this content is also changed and uh, yeah now i would be having your article small so let me just check with this article small yeah so now i would be having the article small and now we would be having three articles small so let me just copy this content control c and uh, i need to change it over here first and uh, the next thing that we would be having is your this so control c and uh, i need to change this so control v and the next thing that is i need to copy the image so control c and then the image is being changed so image is also changed now for this i need to have another 
article small and i need to remove this image and i need to copy it over here from here so i will again copy this image and i'll paste it over here and uh, i need to change this thing so let me just copy it control c and i'll copy it over here control v and uh, control x and let me just copy it over here control p so all the things are done i need to copy this again control c and then two more times so that would be enough so one more time that is your article small one article small two and this is the last article small that i would be having so i need to copy this image control c and i need to replace it with this image control v and uh, let me just copy this thing and paste it over here so i need to paste it over here so control v and i need to copy this thing and i would be pasting it over here uh, sorry i need to just remove this and control v so i have copied all these things and now i would be taking my last image and uh, i would be changing it so i would be changing it like this let me just copy this image and control v so image is being changed and uh, i need to copy the content for the mark zuckerberg so image is copied and uh, let me just change the content for mark zuckerberg and control c and control x and your content is been copied so let me just remove this content i think this content has been extra so now let me just uh, run the live server and let's just check how the output is being looking so let me just shut back and hit on this go live button to start the server so server is getting started and the server is running on port number this and we are getting all the proper images and everything is fine so now we would be working on towards our style tag and we would be designing this whole page so first thing that we would be having is your body and so the content for body that we would be having is your margin as zero and then your padding as zero and then your font size that we would be having is your 16 pixels 16 pixels and then we would be having your line height that is your 1.5 and then your font family as your sans serifs and your background color that we would be having is your hash e7 e7 and yeah this is the color that we would be having so i have changed the color as well and the next thing that we would be talking about is your anchor tag and inside this anchor tag we would be seeing text decoration to none and the next thing that we would be having is your color as white so anchor tag is also there and the next thing that we would be talking about is your bottom links dual tag so we won't be talking about bottom links because this is the part of the sidebar so let's just talk about your news and the images inside that news so we would be saying box sizing to your border box so border box is also done and width is your hundred percent so width hundred percent is also done and then we would be having is your article content and inside this article content article content padding as one rem so padding as one rem is also 
padding as one rem is all yeah. padding as padding as one rem is also done and now we would be talking about article again article and now we would be having your margin as margin bottom sorry margin bottom as one rem and then your margin left as one rem and then your background color as white so background color white and then your dot we would be we won't be talking about anything like this not footer uh, so we would be talking about now header so header and inside this header we would be having your background color as white and then your margin bottom as one rem and the next thing that we would be having is your image tag and inside this image tag we would be having max width as 100 percent so max width 100 percent is also done and uh, we would be seeing some properties for header again so box sizing border box is done and uh, so header box sizing border box is done and width as uh, let me just add it over here as well so box sizing to border box and then we would be seeing width as 100 percent and text align to center so we have added all the proper and now we would be seeing some properties for dot news so news and inside this news we would be having display as your flex and flex direction as row and flex wrap as wrap so we have said all these things now we would be seeing some properties for your uh, small medium and big so for dot big we would be having your width as 100 percent and for dot dot medium for medium we would be having flex as two and for the small we would be having flex as one so dot small we would be having flex as one so that's all and let's just check our output so as you can see our output is working properly fine i think inside this tag let's just go to index.html and the last thing that we have given yeah over here it's article small class so we need to say it as medium and we can check our output so our output would be fine now i think let me just refresh this page and it's not small as well it's a big sorry it's a big big it's not small it's big it's big it's big article is big so yeah now our content would be fixed yeah as you can see our content is fixed and we would be designing the sidebar and your footer in the upcoming videos so i hope that you must have got till now how to design your header and the main just part that is your new so that's all in today's video students i would be seeing you in the next video till then bye bye take care thank you